Hello everyone, welcome to TV channel. Stephen Joe Lifestyle 2024 Biography, Family, Girlfriend, Career and Net Worth Biography and Childhood Stephen Chow Sing Chi is a Hong Kong filmmaker, former actor, and comedian, known for his mostly Tao style, comic timing, and stunts. Stephen Chow was born in Hong Kong on 22 June 1972 in Ling Po Yi, an alumna of Guangzhou Normal University, and Chow Yi Sung, an immigrant from Ningbo, Zhejiang. Chow has an elder sister named Chow Mengke and a younger sister named Chow Sing Ha. Zhou's giving name Xingqi derives from Tang Dynasty, Chinese power Wang Bo's a safe preface to the prince of Tang's pavilion. After his parents divorced when they were seven, Zhou was raised by his mother. Early Life and Career Zhou attended Hip World Primary School, a missionary school attached to the Hong Kong Council of the Church of Christ in China in Prince Edward Road, Kowloon Peninsula. When he was nine, he saw Brooks Lee's film The Big Boss, which inspired him to become a martial arts star. Zhou entered St. Manuel Secondary School, where he studied alongside Lee Kim Yan. After graduation, he joined the TVB's acting classes. After appearing in many Hong Kong television series, Joe's first major breakthrough was the 1989 comedy series The Final Comeback. He then starred in the 1991 action comedy film Fight Back to School, which became one of the highest grossing films of all time in Hong Kong. He later reprised his role in its sequels. In 1984, he made his directional debut with From Beijing with Love. In 2001, Joe directed and starred in the Swartz comedy film Shaolin Soccer, which had a successful worldwide theatrical front and broad show into the North American mainstream. This commercial success was followed by the 2004 martial arts action comedy Kung Fu Hustle. The film received positive reviews and crosses over $106 million worldwide, making it one of the highest crossing foreign language films in the United States. Joe's final film acting performance before he became a full-time filmmaker was in the 2008 science fiction comedy CJ7. Personal Life Joe and Jacqueline Lord met while filming the TV series The Final Combat in 1989 and began dating shortly thereafter. In the autumn of 1992, they broke up. Lord later struggled with depression and recalled mentioning marriage to Joe, only to be dismissed as crazy, would leave her heartbroken. I longed to start a family with him, but he treated me like a lunatic. Years later, when Law announced he had cancer, Joe was working on Journey to the West, conquering the demons. Among other memorial references, he named the film's female lead Miss Run, referencing the final combat, where Joe and Law portrays Mr. and Miss Run, the film premiere after Law's death. Joe and Antonia Ju started dating after working together on Fight Back to School, where a secret relationship lasted for more than three years, ending due to Joe's alert infidelity. In a 2008 interview on Be My Guest, Ju recalled the breakup. One day, after wrapping up work, I went to visit my boyfriend's room. The door was locked, and when he opened it, he looked frustrated. I touched to the bed and it was warm, while the bedroom doors were locked from the inside. Ju stated that she didn't know who the other person was and suspected there were more than just one. Despite this, Ju continued to work alongside Joe until the film finished. Karen Mark, the often respected mistress at the time, denied being involved with anyone during the film of a Chinese or says.
From 1995 to 1998, Joe dated actress and singer Karen Mok, who has starred alongside him in several films, according to veteran Hong Kong journalist Bai Li Mei. Stephen admired Karen's wit and unique personality, and that the former saw the actress as a soulmate with whom he could have deep conversations about movies. So, when he broke up with Athena Chiu, he and Karen started dating secretly. Of all Stephen's past girlfriends, Karen was the one whom Stephen's mom liked the most. Bai Lu Mei said that it's because the actress is cultivated, knowledgeable, and respectful of the elderly. Years ago, Stephen's mom also revealed that even though Stephen doesn't even want to get married, the only woman that he had any intention of marrying was Karen Mo. Joe had a relationship with Alice Yu Man Feng, daughter of business Mongo Yu Ching Bo, for 12 to 13 years until March of 2010, during which Yu also assisted Joe with personal investment and was paid a salary based on the bridal contract from 2002, initially at 20,000 Hong Kong dollars a month. Joe had paid Yu 19.5 million Hong Kong dollars at her request between 2007 and 2011, and an additional 10 million Hong Kong dollars in February of 2012 in the British end for her friendships and support over the years. In September 2012, you feel a lawsuit against Joe, asserting that there was an additional oral agreement purportedly with around Christmas of 2002 for Joe to pay her a 10% share of net profits on all successful investments she recommended. Yu's claim for damage of some 80 million Hong Kong dollars was based on her purported share of the profits from Joe's investment in his current luxury home at Trail Po Lok's Path on the Pig, three houses at the Beverly Hills in Taibo, and the private equity fund. In 2021, a lower court ruled the pair never made that deal, a decision that was appeal on appeal. Hong Kong comedy king Stephen Chow's illustrious career as an actor and director has not only garnered him global recognition, but also a net worth rumor to be at least $251 million. A new Weibo post alleged that the 62-year-old, who is neither married nor has children, has a will for how his assets should be distributed once he dies. Apart from his direct family, it's said that his muses Cecilia Chung and Su Tiao are also listed as beneficiaries. Cecilia was in Stephen's King of Comedy. The 1999 movie scores her one of two Best New Performer nominations at the 19 Hong Kong Film Awards. She won the award for her performance in Fly Me to Polaris. She and Stafford have worked together on other projects through the years such as 2001 Shaolin Soccer and 2019 The New King of Comedy. Su Chiao, on the other hand, plays Stafford's son in the 2008 sci-fi comedy CJ7 when she was only 10. For the role, she was named Best New Performers at the 28 Hong Kong Film Awards. It's said that Su Chiao, now 27, is Stephen's gold daughter and that he's been silently helping her with her finances.